Demos? Yeah, we're up, uh, actually up for promotion today. Oh, excellent. So is our first promotion. Hey! business for so long and he's earned so much respect that's why we're surrounded by so many amazing martial artists uh, he's an amazing martial artist he's been in it forever and he's one of the cornerstones he's one of the legends of martial arts he's a Hall of Famer many times over and uh, he's an amazing gifted martial artist so I'm honored to be here and I'm honored to even be asked by him but to be here so are you ha doing anything special or do you have anything special to say to Eric um, much, much respect, much congratulations, and continued success in everything that you do, sir. Thank you. Okay, stay tuned. talking to Peter. Hi, how are you? And we're going to find out a little bit more about how he came to this event. And we're here at Eric Lee's Extravaganza. Uh, hello, uh, Eric Lee's been my teacher for many years here in California, uh, actually around 20 years. And uh, we've done a lot of seminars and other events together. And he invited me over here. And I'm fortunate enough to be going for my third degree today. So it's a special day for me also, not just for being here for Eric, but for myself. And uh, He's a wonderful man. He's a very energetic. He has a lot of uh, inspirational features about him whenever he's with other people. And uh, just being with him, uh, particularly when we were in Asia together, was a lot of fun. And I truly hope other people join us in our next event when we go to China. Um, he's a wonderful person, and uh, I hope things work out for him in the future. And uh, we proceed with a lot of other instrumental times like this, and that will help other people join us and come to our events. Thanks. Besides being very sentimental and creating momentous occasions, Eric is what? Uh, great martial artist, great friend, uh, good mentor to other people, um, 
truly inspirational to other martial artists who want to come see him and many more things I can't really think of right now, but there's a lot. Thank you, Peter. All right, we're back, and we're talking to another one of Eric Lee's favorite people here at the Eric Lee Extravaganza, and so far. <laughs> Everybody probably says it to you like that. Tell us a little oh, bit yeah. about how you know Eric Lee. Uh, Mr. Eric Lee and I, we have a history for a long time ago. I was one of the, his fans for many years. But the main one, every project, every movie he did, I was the one of the first customer or the interest person to go and see all his beautiful action. And besides, I taught martial arts myself for 18 years. And I love martial arts. I do in the movie. He did so many fantastic movies. So we have a common sense. But the main one, he is one of the best grandmaster I have always loved and respect for him. So besides being great in the business and being your friend, what else can you say about Eric? I can say he is one of the best entertainers, one of the best martial artists, has fantastic, great techniques. His techniques, in most cases, is unusual, is personal. And he's very creative, um, respectful, Martial Thank you very much, Farm. Right. Everybody's doing it here. Now we're talking to Jean-Pierre, and would you tell us a little bit about how you met Eric Lee and why you're here today? I used to have Mount Dojo in Los Angeles uh, 30 years ago, and this is why we become close friends. And uh, I know Eric Lee since 30 years now, and we did a lot of exhibition together and uh, all of that, and in Hawaii and uh, different places. So you're a martial artist then? I'm a martial art artist, yes. And what's your style? My style is called Kitaido, okay? And Ki mean energy, Tai mean body, and Do mean the part, the way. Energy, body, spirit. Excellent. So you like training with Eric then? Yeah, I did train, or we did train together, I would say more, more than that. You know? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, I'm sorry. So it doesn't matter. I, I'm what, the what, one what? talking. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah. Go ahead. And now we're talking to Steve Tyman, the excellent writer. <laughs> and uh, we'd like to know a little bit about how you know Eric Lee and why you're here at Eric Lee's Extravaganza. Oh, boy. Well, uh, Eric and I go way, way back. He was in my uh, Ring of Fire 2, where he did uh, uh, probably one of the funniest roles he's ever done. Uh, I think he was in my death match for a moment or two. But Reverend I, you know, Ring, Leo Fong. <laughs> Ring of Fire 2 is one where he's in for a lot of the film. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. First of all, thank you very much. May I have attention? Uh, we're going to. I'm Eric Lee, in case we don't know. <laughs> don't feel bad, I, I forgot to my name this morning. I have to carry my ID cards. Uh, first of all, we like to uh, have uh, everybody stop what you're doing for a second. And this is uh, Reverend Leo Fong. Uh, he's uh, the old timer. He's close to about 78 years old. Thanksgiving Day. Sorry for this mic. Can you talk? Uh, first of all, we'd like to start him uh, with a prayer. He's a reverend. He's a film producer, actor. I used to compete at his tournament back to the uh, 60s. I was oh, just a youngster then. Look <laughs> what the world had done to me. Uh, anyways, uh, I'm glad everybody's here. I really appreciate There's a lot of people here that, that I knew for a long time. And this is a, a combination of fun, uh, party, and the main thing is brought everybody together because start off whether you're entertainment industry or martial art or health. And I'd like to uh, start off the reverence. 
here to start a prayer. And then we have Diana Lucas. Is she standing by? She will sing national anthem. Okay, we start. <laughs> 